guys, today I'm doing my ear piercings. Here and here. I've had one here before, but I've let it like, heal up. But I'm just feeling a bit creative. It's summer, nice cool vibes. I like experimenting with like different styles of clothing. And I'm like, what the heck, you know, so. The problem is when you go to like piercing places, it's really expensive for what they do and for the time they do it in. It's just, I'm not that rich. And you know what? It's not that hard. <laughs> so I got some cotton buds. I'm gonna use that in case any blood comes out. I got some diluted hydrogen peroxide. This is a very good disinfectant. And I got some metal circular earrings. No fool's metal because you want it to heal up and nothing to prevent that and metal's idea. Don't cheap out because I'm going to have to wait to experiment with all the other cool fun ones I have. And of course in washing the hands really well, I'm going to be doing that like because I did that all the time you see. And I've got like, another reason to go like vegan, vegetarian, paleo, plant based, whatever you want to call it. Using some frozen bees I'm going to like... I'm going to numb my ear up and also I've read to reduce pain good music is really important like you'd be surprised but it relaxes you and that's what I want because you can get a bit anxious when you're essentially self-harming yourself with needles that's the worst case scenario in case this all goes wrong but it won't um, I'm going to put some music on a nice summer tune and let's do it I still have my piercings here and here. I pierced the top of my cartilage here, but if you can see, there's a little bump slash growth slash where the skin has healed. Because I just gave it up actually, because going through cartilage is very messy. It took me over an hour to actually get a piercing through. But then for the month after when it was healing and I was sleeping on it, it got so crusty all the time. And despite cleaning it every day, which I did for my other ears and this for a good month with hydrogen peroxide, it just didn't take. And you know, I was just like, it's not worth it. I want to have this and this and that's it. If you're going to pierce at home, stick to your earlobes. That's actually a bit of fun. That's great. But never cartilage. Get a professional to do that unless you're really badass and just like a reminder at the end like especially like if you're a guy and you don't want to give the wrong impression both ears means you're straight and also if you get a piercing on your left side that also means you're straight just be careful because that's the last thing you want to be doing giving the wrong impression and leading people on nice one guys thank you for tuning in if you like this click a like subscribe and see you next time Check out how I caved in for junk food and the Heathrow protest against pollution.